Hello, welcome back to the shuttle bay. Now, be careful because if you enter the shuttle bay and exit it, you will have to complain about it and you will have to, you know, just accept the fact that you basically close the quest. So, I'm not sure why it was this such a big thing for the developers. So, let's go over this again. Put in trouble, translate. I already did this. So you enter, you leave, oh so let me guess, so if you walk out of this place right now, oh, so they give you the warning when you use the elevator. That's one of the weirdest way to say something. I mean, when you use an elevator, you usually press yes, you don't. Okay, so that's what I did and that's how I lost it. So now you can no longer enter the shuttle. But even though you don't do much, that's, that's a bit, you know, absurd in my opinion. Let's load the game. I think I saved, yeah. Okay. So you are not warned about leaving this place that will cause the quest to fail you're only going to get warned when you use the elevator but it does make sense because nothing happens nothing bad happens to the place you leave now the situation will resolve without you and the quest doesn't change if you leave travel to the shuttle bay Yeah, I think this will be fixed in, or I don't know, maybe it will be the same in the full list of the game. But that seems a little bit weird because you're not seeing any visible changes. I mean, only the door is closed, but this is a huge area and you're expected to buy a lot of things and do a lot of things here. I don't know why they designed it like this. I guess I understand the logic behind it, but I just cannot accept it from the gameplay stand of view and other things. Again, we went through all of this the last time I was here. And if you lose access to this area, it's a huge loss because you're going to lose a lot of experience as well for, to the stealing part, which will most likely be enough to make you level 5, which will be enough to get you to steal all of the stuff from the other areas. Pepper box mark 2. So, what? He has a mark 3, or what is this? 5 shooter. And I guess that's different, more or less. By the way, when they say all cobra, I think this is also a translation error. They shouldn't then say all cobra, they should say earth cobra or all the. Uh, all design cobra, or something like that. I mean. It's not an old Cobra from uh, the years, I mean this gun is not 100 years old, it's just newly produced on the colony ship. And I saw some that this description is very well explained on some guns, but on the other ones it's not as well explained what it means. Well I guess you could technically buy something from here if you need it. Well, to be honest, I think I'll need to buy a few med kits. So I'm not constantly thinking about how much med kits I have or if I'll run out of them. Okay, so let's go with the shuttle bay in a more relaxed way. <laughs> likes to brew it. Their line with heat absorbers on the inside. Oh, interesting. So, I guess it's just a decision to stop getting more refugees and nothing else. Buck. Oh, okay. 
Okay, so I guess you cannot leave. They should have just made it more clear. I don't know. Sometimes I, I'm maybe I'm just viewing things too much from the point of view of the player, but not a developer. But you really want to make sure nobody misses content on accident. So let's go look at the quest. <coughs> United with Saint Jonas. Okay. So we have to make an alliance. New Dawn Church, they even have their own little church. Just like the aesthetics of this place. Never mind, the answer is no. Plain old Nicky Bolton. Little late in the day for a palaver. Palava. I guess this is just the French for talking or negotiating. The protector should be here in less than 24 hours. They'll kill anyone who resists and can skip the rest. Our options are go down with the refugees or drive them out by force and save everyone's life in the process. This is the protector's angle. The brotherhood has a foothold in the factory. The protectors have a bad craving for their own base outside the habitat and the shuttle bay is just the juiciest fruit in reach. But you could have taken the shuttle bay years ago. Ah, oh, okay. Well, I guess this is another. We need an alliance. I'm not sure if I. I'm pretty sure you cannot create a new faction, so it doesn't matter what you do. I'm also kind of tempted to fight the enemies, the protectors. Okay, I'll see if I can convince them. <clears throat> Confrontation to protect protectors only to force us to the bigger fight of the Brotherhood. Oh, okay, so I guess faction is out of the out of question. One of your fighting men. Let's see if we make a deal with the church. Join Sarov. I should turn it to J. I guess we have to explore all of the options. Yeah, and this is another thing I don't like. A lot of people just load or reload the game when it comes to things like this. I mean, you would want to play 20 hours again just to get this option. Well, I, yeah, I think we'll have a lot of fun when the full release is out, but again, I just cannot advance to the... Sometimes the game is just so stubborn that I cannot advance. Well, okay. So you have a lot of options, you have a lot of things, but I think the problem is it all boils down to one or two decisions. Where okay, so you are staying and they want to fight. Are these the refugees? What's your story? <sighs> I 
I don't like any of these options. I mean, sometimes the diplomacy in, in this game, Persuasion and Street Rising Impression 8, feels a lot more like, I don't know, feels a lot like sentencing people to die. So I don't think that was a persuasion per se. Okay, I think I have seen enough, so let's choose the option that will let us fight. Mm. Yeah, let's try and fight. So see, this is what I'm talking about. You, it makes it sound like you have two options, but you only had one option. Azar. Okay, so that was not really even a working point. New leader. Okay, this is a little weird. Oh, I cannot wait and to return to Hargrave and kill him. Okay, so what is the point of all of these characters all over the place? And I'm... <sighs> I think I'm just getting lost in save files and save games because I'm not really going anywhere with this MI. Okay, you know what, I think I've forgotten what I'm supposed to do, I don't know, it's just a complicated mess sometimes, the, the storytelling of the game. The refugees, what's your story? I'm trying to fight the protectors, but apparently that's not the right decision, and so it's super hard to make it. The talking kind of equates to make convincing them to leave. Okay, where's the second leader? Hmm. Puzzle game. Can you... I don't know, I'm just tired of... Okay, let's find a, a solution to this mess because it seems like I want to do something that the game doesn't let me do, but it tells me I could do it if I wanted. Okay, so this is... What you're supposed to do. Well, I guess it's one of the options. 
I'm not sure how many options you have, but again, you don't want to replay a game just to see the other option, which is more or less the same. Okay, so now we have the option of talking to the mother. Oh, that's a surprise. Wait it out. I guess we killed Moses, okay. Maybe. I also need to make the dialogue a little better, so they probably need to say mm, the name of the character when where it's, when he speaks or something like that. You don't say father, again, it, it gets confusing. Just put the name over here, Father Nico, and whatever he says. And probably Nate, whatever, I don't know. They need to make this a little better. Use this your plan all along. Who is Nazar? Where can I find these people? It's such a small map, but I'm having trouble finding people. Man, I forgot I need the lockpick. Such a, I've never seen such a confusing game like this one. I mean, I wanted to make them join the church, but apparently I ended up, ended up killing the leader to do something that I didn't do, and I cannot find Nazar now. Okay, I have, it's, took, it's only a little quest, <clears throat> but I feel like it's going to take me a long time until I figure it out, so let's... Let's reload the game. Let's enter the area. Let's steal the stuff, and this time we'll go over the option of making them join the church, probably. If it's possible, again, you don't know if it's possible because they send you here for an alliance with Jonas, but clearly that will not be possible. I find it super confusing. What's the protector's angle? Again, it doesn't matter what you say to him, you have to talk to Jane, he'll tell you more interesting things. It... So that's the short version, how do I get the version where he says about the, st the stuff about the church? Let's go through the other option again. <laughs> so he tells us about Father Nico, but again, you don't really get more options than that. The 
Could I imagine they, he told me to... Okay, I'm terribly confused. I thought I, they, he had the dialogue line where he tells us they will join the church. It's getting more and more confusing, sorry about this. Do I really have to watch my own video to understand what was the option that showed me that I can have them join the church or something? Oh, okay. Okay, so that's the big grand choice. Let me find that other guy. I would assume he would be somewhere around here, but I don't see him anywhere in Nazir or whatever his name was. Yeah, I am totally confused on this quest because again it gives the impression you have a lot of choices, but I think you only have one or two. That means he spits and spits and looks away. I guess you have to choose the option for another shepherd. Ah, you know what? I think I'm tired, and I think we'll reach the same conclusion whatever we choose. I'm just annoyed that I cannot find Nazar. Let me Google it. It's a small area and you have such a huge problem understanding what the quest entails. Yeah. Okay, it looks like we have another option, but I need to find that guy. So I guess the thing I'm thinking of is maybe, you know, getting him, changing the Moses or Nico, and then convincing the protectors these people are under the protection of the church. You know what, I think I will give up. I'll just look at online because I cannot find a stupid NPC. I'll look at the video. It's incredible how, how little fun I can have sometimes in this game.
Ah, good luck finding anything about the game. Nice, I don't know how his supporter looks, but I cannot see where he is. No, I'll, I'll just leave the video like this because it's, it's early access, but it shouldn't be this frustrating to just solve a little quest. I mean, I just want to see the other option. Is that so hard? Probably it is. Near the stored shuttles. Where? And this is why my review will probably always remain negative. I've been trying banging my head on a wall for what 10 minutes over here trying to find an NPC to solve a simple quest like this one. It's such a small area with only one single quest and I can near the stored shuttles. I don't see him anywhere. Uh, don't tell me he's in the long house, that would be funny. So if they say, if they tell me like this, that means they're both here, right? Okay, let's go through the process again. The four people die now. I guess Jay will die as well. Is it a bug? If it didn't spawn for me, or I don't get it. And yet the stored shuttles. Those people died, and I guess I cannot loot them. You got to be joking me. You got to be joking me. So the developers decided this was a good idea to hide an important character in the story in a small room and put a guard in front that doesn't open the door for you. But doesn't even mean... Okay, okay. Okay, fine, I, I, okay.
I don't understand. Where are the dialogue options for the character to do what they specifically want me to do? Hmm. Maybe I'm missing some, <clears throat> some critical story elements or something. It's really, really missing from the story. But I thought they told me to speak with him as well. So, Father Nico is in charge. Yeah, at this point I'm just lost in the scenery. Cannot believe how oh okay now the door is highlighted. I guess if you reach this part of the quest the door will be highlighted, but oh there. I think 50% of my time in this game is just traveling around or moving around. Okay, yeah. oh, okay, I'll not redo the video, I'm tired, sick and tired of this, that's far enough, the door is open now, we can speak with him, you are welcome, if you join the Rackleman, Nikos Rackleman, eh, eh. Doesn't mean... Okay... I want to help them keep them alive. I guess I can... Eh, yeah, whatever. I have so many problems with this chain of events over here and this... I think this will be cleaned up in the full release, but... He's just clicking from one side of the map to the other side of the map in a very very awkward way because father Nico is over here now so okay okay so we basically had to choose a few options and for those options we had to waste 30 minutes he accepted anything I can help Want the soldiers? <laughs> go and see what they want. Find me. I go to the on site. I'm not ready to be mortal just yet. That's also true. Hmm, well, I guess they have quite a shooting line over here with the turrets. I don't think people realize this, but hey, those are real turrets over there. I like the attention to details, but I don't think anyone else will notice them or... What a broken piece of a quest this is. Here to parlay. If I remember correctly, this guy is a high ranking officer in the Protectorate. So that means he has good loot. Where is Mo Jackson? Moses, Thunder Nico is in charge. Twenty minutes. I guess you can use that one, okay, so we have a non-violent option, or an option where we don't die very very fast. 
this is the exact thing I'm looking for. But I also want the experience, so we'll get the streetwise experience. Oh no no no, I chose that wrong. I specifically want the persuasion experience. And then we'll fight him. Persuasion. Huh, at least they teleported us over here. I rather hell I rather fight with you. <sighs> Is the game still trying to me make me choose something? And this is again the same problem. Where am I supposed to go? Why is it such a big chore? I selected a dialogue option that should directly that should put me over there at least. I give up, I give up. So, this is the worst design quest in the entire game and I don't understand why. Why is this so badly designed? So that's before the fight. Is this area not finished or what's the deal? Because this is the buggiest and most annoying area. You have such a long quest line to only do the same thing. Okay, let's spend another 10 minutes like idiots looking for the stupid manhole cover because the developers cannot be bothered to make a streamline quest. Oh, are you joking? This is... Okay. What? I assume this is a somewhat easy task, so let's see how the big battle is. Uh, I don't think we'll fight Rowley if we choose this option. And the main point is to loot that guy. Okay, so I think we explored all of the options that were given to us. You can solve this conflict by diplomacy, but diplomacy is the weaker solution because it doesn't solve the bigger problem at hand. Well, I guess they'll hate me after this, but I... I guess you know the rules. I refuse to do stealth. Oh, 
No, he has initiative bonus even though we have... Okay game, whatever you say, so 53 is lower than 40. Um, I guess I didn't play a lot of stealth missions, so I don't know the way it's calculated. If it did happen during combat. Just, just to run over there and don't make an, any noise. I guess that guy is a very tough one. He's just heal and... Blind that character and then shoot him. That worked better than expected. Oh, he has a SMG. Not really a commander weapon or a squadron leader weapon. Doesn't matter. Well, I guess we we'll just have to use snapshots and get a lot of staggers. I didn't thought that rifle could graze, but okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, that was funny. We lose reputation, return to Nico. I guess you don't get to loot them. Uh, you know what, let's just do this the old fashioned way. This is the stuff that was mounted on the turret. I guess you have to come over here before you leave, otherwise you miss the sweet loot. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, so... Yeah, this is the squad leader implant. That This is another way to get a squad leader implant, but I guess you... 
have to kill Rowley for it. What stuff did they have? <coughs> I guess they don't even have much. The... Oh, that's a good rifle. <coughs> but you practically get one for free on your way here. Energy shield unupgraded, enforcer. Okay, so I guess this is the armor that is not damaged, and you get a red explorer coat. Well, I guess it's more or less nice. The loot is not bad since you get stuff that is not damaged. So this is 10 10. Doesn't have an action point bonus, an action point debuff. So oh, he's a trooper now, <laughs> a real trooper. So that was the damage one. Hey, what was the good one? Then eight eight. So, I guess it's more or less the same thing. Nice. In case you didn't have a river, I think you get 10... You, I'm, no, I think you get 2 or 3 rivers on your way here. 3, 3, 4... I guess it's more or less the same, and I don't want to give away the white one. I like the blue one. This one is a little more aggressive. And he cannot wear on. Okay, so I guess that's more or less everything. We got the implants. Well, if nothing else, this will be good. My ally, 60 creds. Uh, keep in mind, ours is upgraded with a chip. I guess you cannot use that, okay, you cannot use that thing again. Okay, so that was the entire quest line, even though it was a little annoying. And by little I mean hugely annoying and a little bit disappointing. How much did we lose with the, oh yeah, yeah. We, we lost quite a bit with the protectors. Also before I end the video, I just want to see what happens here. I don't think we'll get new weapons or new stuff over here. <coughs> no, it's the same things. Does he get another visor helmet? It's nice because it gives you that thermal vision, the accuracy. And the optical resistance, yeah, but I would lose the reaction 5%. You know what, I think it's worth it because it's a lot better. <laughs> okay, now we're really, really looking like, you know, people who know how to fight. I'll have to sell a lot of these, uh, sell a lot of implants as well. Damage energy cannon, okay, thank you. Yeah, that was a bit of a weird start, but I guess we did okay. And before I leave... Uh, remember, you cannot go back to the pit. Yeah, so before I end the video, I just want to go back over here and let's see if he has more options for us. So I guess they have a new leader, they fought with the Protectorate, the Protectorate lost, even though it's not clear how or why, they had more people. Probably all of, the, all of those turrets did a lot of the work. Nazar. I guess you can technically kill Nazar and get the loot, I should have killed them as well. 
I'll do that in the full release. For now, I just wanted to make sure the faction is at full strength and nothing bad happens to them. And that would have probably been a big... I don't know, I'm just role-playing. See you next time. Bye.